an inspiring sight and an ambitious plan. Seven military aircraft and seven field guns, the helicopters synchronizing their maneuvers to lift the weapons. The Chinooks go first, lifting a gun each. Then the Pumas take their turn at the next gun line. It's a first for 7th Parachute Regiment Royal Horse Artillery and 16 Air Assault Brigade, working with the Joint Helicopter Support Squadron. This is a small part of a large exercise, so this for us is called Exercise Decisive Manoeuvre 2. Uh, so this is a joint exercise between Puma Force and Chinook Force. And we're doing something that we've never tried before. We're going to try and do a seven-gun lift at once. What do you hope to achieve from the exercise? What's the outcome? Well, good outcome is showing a capability that this is a option available for us to use if we ever want to do it and it shows that um, support helicopter can work with our counterparts on the ground as well. An exercise like this relies on careful planning and the challenges are many. It's both the time taken to prepare the guns uh, to move, um, it's the coordination of the guns in this particular space prior to being picked up and then obviously then the coordination of what occurs at the other end um, when they're actually dropped off to the, such that they are able to then uh, carry on to, uh, undertaking the primary role that they're here to do, which is to provide fire support. So there's a number of challenges at, at both ends, really involving quite a large amount of people. Each gun weighs over a thousand pounds, and lifting it requires perfect coordination between those on the ground and those in the air. The ability to move uh, these light guns in theatre um, quickly and efficiently um, is a really important aspect of 16 Brigade's capability um, as it moves forward to ensure that it has the right level of fire support. Um, in the battle space as required. So this is really a validation that we are um, properly trained and able to integrate um, with uh, the helicopter force in doing this, but then also coming out in good order at the far side to, um, to be able to support the brigade as it moves forward. Once the guns are lifted, the helicopters have to hold them steady. It means all seven aircraft can fly off in formation, while the ground crew take pride in a successful exercise.